this is how you can create and make a schedule on your iPad. So it depends on what exactly you want to achieve as in my opinion, there are like two types of this. Uh, one is a little bit more flexible and other is like a very rigid schedule. So whatever you like, I'm going to show you the options. So if you would like to get a schedule, something like a timetable, then I would recommend you to get a third party app from the app store for it. And there are plenty of different apps which you can download, but one which I personally used in the past is called Class Timetable. I'm not affiliated with them in any way, and it, it is a free app which you can get. There are some in-app purchases, but for some basic features, the free version is gonna be enough. And using this app, you can create a very nice uh, color-coded like daily schedules. So you essentially just choose a day and you have some scheduled activities for that day. It is ideal for students because you can see that every single Thursday, for example, from 11 a.m. to 12 p.m. or whatever, the same activity is going to be repeated. And you also color code it so you can see it visually when you look at your whole day or week, which type of activity is, you know, pertaining to which uh, parts of the day and how many times you are doing it. So it is really convenient and it is a good way to schedule your that, uh, day that way, right? So this is kind of how it works. You also have widgets and integration into your Mac and iPhone. So it's a great app if you ask me. However, it's not very flexible, right? So for a lot of people, they don't really have the same day repeating every week, Instead, they need to use a calendar. And of course, we have a built-in Apple calendar, but I personally like to use the Google calendar as this can be integrated into various different third-party apps as well. So I quite like that. And there you can also just schedule some things, but also just make it very flexible. And literally for me, every single day is kind of different, but I still need some kind of structure for it. So I use calendar a lot more for this purposes. So let me know below in the comments which type of person you are, which uh, widgets, I mean, sorry, which kind of like timetables or uh, time management you prefer. Let me know about that. Subscribe for more tutorials in the future and I'll see you in the next one.